Good morning, everyone. It is early as heck. And uh, let me turn this music on so. And it is foggy as heck. So, my apologies for the darkness on the video. My son and I, Xavier, were headed up to meet some friends and we're going to Riverside. We went there last year and met Salty Styles. This year, Salty couldn't make it due to some engine failure. It happens. But we're gonna be hanging with some friends. We're gonna be checking out some cool cars. So stick along for the ride. Should be a good one. Quick update. Met up Chance with his S14. Picked up two TTs. And two SUVs. So that's the car van going down. Should be there in about an hour and a half. So we're over here now. Got the cars wiped down, got everybody stage, got together. Yeah. Alright boys pulling forward to show their turbo setups. But pretty much in early, I think we have about 20, 30 more minutes before the doors are open. People are still coming in. Looks like a good turnout. We'll walk around check some cards in a little bit. I need to get something to eat. Well, well, well. Walking up to start view and what do I see? A 510. Golly. Look at that thing. Got some OG Panasports. Alabama car, man. That's cool. I can't wait to get my done, man. Oh my goodness. There's still some people coming in. Not totally done. But yeah, visitors are definitely being allowed in. Seen a lot of imports this year. Dang. You know me, I'm not a big Honda boy, but this thing is clean. Sheesh. I was thinking about putting my rack on the car this morning before we head out, but decided not to. I need to start back hitting the trails. I think we uh, might be obligated to stop and check out each RV that's in here. Haul at the haters. This guy is actually local. I may need to have to find him to probably do a ride along. Here's Alex's car with his big old wing. Oh, really? Recently, when we did the video, he didn't have the wing on then, but he just recently got this. It's pretty much almost brand new, old stock. Some guy had it sitting on a shelf forever. He was going to put it on his car, but never did. And Alex found it and slapped it on. I guess, man, that is exact width of the car. That's a wang, man. Nice job, Alex. It looks good. This thing is crazy. Ah. <sighs> V1 Nismos, man. V1 Nismos is stealing my heart. And look at that one. Two-tone red. Not a V1, just a 350, sorry. But a two-tone red. Golly. What do you think, Zebby? Yeah. Should I trade a Jeep for one of these? these most uh, of them. No? 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 Yeah, no. no. keep the G. Man, look how beautiful these two tones are. I guess that bumper was repainted and they messed up the match. Like my prime, like car scene. <laughs> Z1 showed up, brought the raffle car, and then they brought their, uh, I guess their, their advertisement car with all their goodies on it. Is what I guess what you would call it. We got some skunky, skunky weed going on up in here too. Oh shit! Ooh. I see a bird flying. Or you, you hide it for the camera? What's up, man? Why wouldn't you air out? What's up? What's up, dude? Why don't I air out? 
Cause I, cause I always air out. I just wanted to be, you know, be static. I want to be like you. What? Static. I don't want to air out. Well, you'll see it in a little bit. He's harassing me because I just aired a little bit, not totally out. Oh, can we? Man, that damn two-tone red, man. Jeez. <laughs> two-tone red 350. This is stupid clean. I always loved these M35s. Just always loved them. M45, sorry. This is a USD M1. It says, he said this was a factory color, but look how he did the turns on the trim, that's beautiful. Super clean, under the hood is super clean too. I think it's Cedric, a Cedric front end, you know what I'm saying? It's just a gorgeous car. Super clean, got a nice C32 on air. And of course, my love, my also love. You know me, guys, I am giddy for a freaking Kai truck. I want one so bad. Let's, let's forget about buying Xavier a car and buying me a Kai truck. All right. Let's, let's forget about getting him a car. Forget forget the youngin and, and, and get me a Kai truck. <laughs> Gotta check out all the RBs. Ooh, this from Counter-Steer. So Georgia, right? Right, guys, Counter-Steer's in Georgia? HKS Turbo PRP goodies, man. This is a build. Another nice Z32. Few Z32s. Some GTR wheels. You know that's that's just so underrated right now. I remember when the f person first did that swap, everyone was like, what the fuck? Because <laughs> the wheels were so expensive back in the day. And some SSR SP3s. Those wheels are always awesome. Always awesome. I would say if you're going that look, probably do a 20 inch, but they're still clean. And then we got our, 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 our eight boys we came up with. Now this piece of shit kooky right here. I don't know who owns it. He probably gobbles bananas. Yeah. There's some frozen bananas over there too, though. One shot. One shot. Banana. One shot banana. <laughs> <laughs> and then some Ooh. asshole here that just refuses to air out. You're right. So yeah, everybody, everybody keeps asking this fool why doesn't he air out? I don't know. Just some dumbass. Ooh. Runs yeah, runs back, doesn't even air out. What a douche. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Battery's looking good. I don't think that is magma. I think that's the wrap. Hey, you need to know. Is that Genesis? What is that thing? A blue Genesis? That is a Genesis. Look at the shifter. Uh, the shifter? Okay. Is it? Ooh. I like that quarter. Carbon, Carbon quarter, yeah. A little, a little wide, yeah. Oh, no, it's a bolt on. But it's still cool. What's up? That's, that's clean, that's clean. That's sturdy, but we, we need to take a look at the shift. Oh, oh, look at that. It's a nice, pretty little swan. How you doing there, little swan? How you taking it easy in your little um? And a nice SRZ, man. It's a nice SR swap. God's engine. A pretty. The color, man. Hey, fancy meeting you here. Hey. 
<laughs> like ships passing in the night. <laughs> oh man. I'm trying to remember the name. But I know the evil trim is so cool. So cool. So cool. And then look at that president over there, that kit. Damn, that's a crazy kit. Tons of JDM cars, man. This is beautiful. I think they're gonna be like 400 or so. Of those? Yeah. Really? The Evo trim. Hey, what's up, man? And this kid is wild, dude. Look at that kid. That's like some, uh, whatchamacallit, some, um, <laughs> I can't think about it. Some Gundam shit. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, like Gundam was, damn, that, that kid is wild. Whew. Dang. Comes here, you gotta get a shot for like from here. So you see the front and the side and frame it. Ooh, look at that cookie. No, not cookie, sorry. Um, S13. Well, yeah. Ah. That's Chris's friend. Chris' friend just bought that. He got it cheap as hell. It's a HR Z 350. It's pretty cool. It's really clean. Chris with the um, the the oh, why am I, I'm brain farting today? Chris with the Type R and the 350. Nismo oh, yeah, yeah, Turbo, yeah. yeah. Asian Chris. Is that a 2J? Damn! That's very rounded. Co the cookie, um, not cookie. Zankies are nice. Zankies are nice. Retro headlights. Yeah, look, fuck the <gasps> wheels though, bro. Yeah, that's the wheels that though, car. bro. I Golly, I just saw the wheels, bro. Yeah, those wheels, those wheels are nice. Wait. Wait a minute, what? Are those four? Oh, those what? They are four lug. Oh, even better. That is four lug. Even better. That's even more rare, huh? Yeah. <laughs> got, is that an adapter? Chance has a chubby right now. What? Chance has a chubby right now. <laughs> He spotted the four log got a chub right now. Oh no. <laughs> oh you did? Sorry, I still got Alright. What up Adam? Nike Calvin store, I swear they're gonna have for 20. I got these Looking good in the peach. Damn, that's a nice FD. Zave, hold on. I don't wanna ruin the guy's photo. Go ahead. That's cool. It's a very clean, beautiful engine bay. The wheels are nice too. That uh, ah, that SSR super super something chrome. What does it call that finish? You know that finish. You're a wheel person. Oh, that. Yeah. I don't know. I forget what's called it. But that's a that's a uh, SSR option. Yeah. Do you? Nice. I'm I'm probably gonna get this road. Really Are they? I'm not a fan. You know, they got the two piece? Are they two pieces? Yeah. Some VI Pizzos over here. Oh, wagon. A cord wagon. Look at that shit. I haven't seen that in forever. Now, this looks. The other one slammed. It just looked. Huh? Not it. This, yeah, this one, this one. This one fits the bill, you know? This one looks like a typical Drift Zanke. I like the rear, the rear spoiler, like a drag style spoiler, flat. Zanke's are cool. I miss my Zanke. 
My factory ass, Woo. thank you. Yeah? Dang. What are you selling for? Oh, yeah, uh, when we had cage. Oh, okay. I thought I was going to need it to pay medical bills. You didn't? It turned out I didn't. <laughs> That's the best part. <laughs> and I called the guy to buy it back. Oh. And he has wrecked it and sold it to his cousin. Oh, my God. And I called his cousin and he had taken it to the junkyard. Golly. Yeah. It's just so much better than that. Jeez. Isn't it? I was, yeah, would I you recommend a van? I bet. So then I started hunting, and then that's what I ended up with. Okay. <laughs> hey, there's some more of that rat you like. What, uh, that peach rat? I don't know, that's a different time one. That's a different flip. Oh, oh there's a yellow Z. Like so many, I'm, I'll, so I have my yellow Z. I love my yellow Z. It's one of the coolest old school colors, but I'm kind of tired of seeing the, seeing the new Proto spec. Dang, I was just about to say that. I'm, I, I'm as sad to say, it's cool and all, and years beyond now, I Proto specs are gonna be cool because they're gonna be rare. I think they ruined the older Z by bringing that color back. The color is cool. The problem is, is that there's so much so right now. In a couple of years, the yellow is going to be rare. They're going to have a lot more other colors out. But right now, it's just a yellow overload in that car. And of course, everybody has freaking S1s. I need to sell my damn S1s. <laughs> Golly, I just got those wheels. You see? I mean, it's a cool car and everything. It's a very cool color, but they're just... There's just so many yellow ones. I want to see different colors. In a couple of years, I'm sure the yellow will be worth it and it'll be really cool. But right now, it's so much. Kai car. I have to get Xavier a car and I have to get my daughter a car. So I want to try. I want to try and get him a manual 350. Yeah. If that's if I can find one reasonably priced. That's the issue. That's the issue. That's the problem. Oh, minimum 10 grand now, right? Minimum 10, probably, yeah. No. Two-tone. LS, let's keep walking. <laughs> Fuck that shit. I'm getting tired of that shit. It's rinse and repeat. Some little JDM gems down there. Speaking about JDM gems, look at this little thing. The gull wing doors. What is this? That's some Suzuki. Oh, so let's go take a look. Man, that's spacious inside. Somewhat. It's a Suzuki something. It still doesn't have a badge. It's, 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 it's cool. Look at the climate control house. Yeah, vertical. Man, that's so many cool JDM things. JDM things. I say get rid of all the technology. Just have it roll. Just old and roll. Yeah. Start a car company where there's no technology. Kind of like, uh, uh, what's it, Lotus? What they do? Oh, yeah, the bare minimums. Yeah. What is this brown thing? He's got twins. It's two of them. One's blue and one's brown. They're both Suzuki's. So cool. And a DeLorean with Watts. <laughs> no. <way. laughs> I gotta get that. <laughs> Dang. Nah, uh, this is a work of art. DeLorean with Watts. That's cool. Let's go see what's in the back of it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Really? It's a head scratcher? It's like ITV setup, and uh, what we don't know is the, the motor is. 
the one that came with it, it's, it's worked on, definitely. Definitely, so, yeah. If it's a Renault. That, that, that's probably the original. <laughs> so, V6. It's a small V6, which is what came with. Yeah. It is, yeah. Not being the DeLorean specialist I am, <laughs> I cannot really say if this is indeed a factory engine with ITVs. <laughs> That's great, yeah, it's crazy. They came that way? No. Oh. It came it came with a V6. But we don't know if this is a factory V6 or not. It's cool though. I heard uh, uh, Walker said the paddle for me said that it sounded really gnarly coming in. Sheesh. That's cool. That is cool. Take it easy, man. Have a good one. Dude, right? Wild wind. I'm I guess that's a trim. That brown one, I'm kind of digging a lot. So you like brown? Brown bananas now. Yes. Okay. That's that's the theme for today. You know, most people don't eat brown bananas. No, they actually don't. They cut I'll it out. Oh, you just guzzle it down. I'll eat green ones, brown ones, yellow ones. See, you love them all. Love to taste the rainbow, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> taste the rainbow. Taste them all. <laughs> I don't. I don't. Don't discriminate with his bananas. <laughs> Well, look what we just walked into. Yeah, Lee. Tees. So the tees. Everybody got tees and everybody got S ones. Hey, we hate. What we need is some old school shit Ooh. out of Impul. Ooh, look at those wheels. Now that is some old school wheels. That is nice. What a beautiful car, man, you see? You see why I'm sad my car is factory? Because it could look something like this. Yeah. Go build it. I can't. I have to get another one. I can't build that one. That one's been on the front stage and Nissan's really revealed. You're right. It's matching numbers engine. It's a little VIN. We'll get another one. I know a guy that's got two of them. Adam's trying to sell his right now. That's a steal. You need to buy that. I'm down to do Well then. Well then. All the vibrations you need. Take your girl for a pleasure ride. Damn, I love these. I do love these. This... My biggest... My biggest gripe is the LC. Yeah, LC. Yeah. LC. Yeah. The biggest gripe I have with Toyota is that they developed this platform just for Lexus. The Super could have used this. The Super could have used this platform. They didn't have to go with a Bupro. You're right. That there could have been this with a different body. Toyota did Super owners dirty. They should have used that platform. Because everybody was like, platforms are expensive to make, platforms are expensive to develop. They had the LC platform. They should have used that. There's absolutely no reason why they went with a Bupro. The VSP styling. I'm not gonna lie, I really want a daily. Hell yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> twin turbo V, well, it's not twin turbo. I think it's a V6 single turbo, right? 30 d Yeah, single turbo. I'm trying to figure out who is Phil, because he sent me a friend invite, but I don't know exactly who he is. But that is his FD. That's a ridiculous Ooh. fucking FD. That's the guy that was No, no. That was another guy. So I talked to this guy on Facebook, but he never shows a picture of himself, so I don't know who exactly he is. His name is Phil. But this is fucking Ooh. ridiculous. SEMA. That's crazy. Look at the bottom, how it is. You don't open.
Evans, and that's a relief for the side skirts. I like it. That's crazy. You don't like Tom Tom? That's pretty, that's pretty interesting, that body kit. Very interesting body kit. Oh my God, it's an M3. It's an E30 M3. The one of the few BMWs I love. The beautiful E30 behind there. But look at that M3, god dang. That sedan's cool too. A little BBS in the in the headliner and the uh, headliner, but the windshield banner. That's clean. Watch out, Zay. Okay. Tell me what car this is. You probably don't know what to begin with. But okay, I'll make it easier. Is this an uh, import or an American domestic car? Question. Huh? It's a trick question. It is a trick question because it is an import yeah. with an American face. This is a S50, S14, like what we had, the, the white car yeah. with a boss front end. And the boss front end is a JDM front end, made to look like an old school muscle car. So yeah, pretty cool. That's clean. This is the S15 from the last Riverside we're here. It was hoodless. Same yellow engine with the cage. I think it was incomplete back then, but now it looks like it is done. Such a clean build. This is, this is it. What is it? I mean, I, I get the yellow. It stands out. Yeah. Contrast. Yeah. It would have been cool if it matched the cage, or the cage matched one or the other. Exactly. That would have been nice. Exactly. I, do, I personally, when I dress, I don't match the shit. But other than that, yes. I mean, the detail is outstanding. The wheels are really cool and nice. But what about it do you dig the most? The wheels, the air outs, the custom rack for the back? Custom rack. I can do without the color. Everything else is spot on. It is cool. Now these, these are totally bad. Oops. We came through here earlier while we were getting settled down in the show. And these time attack hill climb cars are just fucking phenomenal. Uh, for the love of me, I cannot remember the name of the guy that builds them, but he's in Florida. I have all his damn pins, his lean custom pins, but they're so freaking cool. Just purpose build, raw arrow, oh shit. 
everything, cross friends, so many pictures. It's so awesome. Another awesome, I don't know, it's swapped. Never mind. Never mind. It's swapped. It doesn't have this, but this is fucking Ooh. gorgeous. That R8 with that ghost. This is fucking Ooh. beautiful. Yeah, this is, okay, eighteen, twenty thousand dollars. Twenty thousand dollar wheels. This is a beautiful car. Beautiful build, man. And a crap ton of people. Yeah. The fitment is just ridiculous. It's just fat. It's just fat. Toyo proxies, all triple eights, all around. It's gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Woo. I'm getting hot, man. Could that be four wheels drive something? I, I don't know anything about it. <laughs> Not Honda Boys. Not Honda Boys. <laughs> so somebody put in a comment. Yeah, please do. I, have I don't know what that 4WS is. Four wheel steer? It could be four wheel steer instead of four wheel drive. I don't know. Probably. Because back around that time, Hikus and all that stuff okay. was going around. My car has Hikus or it did have Hikus. So. Okay. So it could be hikers. Yeah. This century is ridiculous. Ridiculous. It's VIP to the max. Start up, yeah. You got the kick through. So the person in the back can put the feet on rest. Man. Xavier or something like that so he could drive me around. Yep. Um, oh, you don't want no VIP? I do like one, but not for you. Shit. Shit. Little kid, he don't know. Driving clients around to look at houses and that? Man. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Bunch of champagne, some bubbly water in the back. The clients exactly. are going to be like, oh, this realtor is the best. He bougie. <laughs> a bougie reel to pull it up in a VIP, got some bubbly water in the back. <laughs> Ooh. 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 Man, that's some cool cars. You know, looking at these two sedans, these two R30s. So lately, because of the R34 getting so freaking expensive, I've been falling in love with the R32. Yeah. I have. I dig the border one. It's cool. It's cool. Is that one back there too? So that one back there is kind of cool. So I bought the Nismo wheel for the 510, but I don't want to do a quick release. I'll see my game on some of those flip ups. Yeah, I like flip ups. I like the flip ups. Yeah. My works bell. Not the not the um, the uh, American one, but the Works Bell one. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's Tennessee Nismo. Yeah. I like the it smells JDM too, man. They have fresher inside, you can smell it. You smelling it? That old school smell? Man. Yeah. That's cool. Stanstow GTT, GSTT, it's one of those things. This is gorgeous. Oh, sorry. Man. Man. Okay, not gonna lie, 
the door ruined it for me. I'm only at half staff right now, not a full job. But that's cool. That bar in the back is elaborate. Holy crap. That's a very elaborate system. Wow. Yeah. So we haven't really gone to the front of the parking lot yet. Making our way over there to see what's going on. Is that what that is? That is definitely Mexi stance. Zanke. Ooh, the wheels. The wheels are good on there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is Alex's car that we did the ride along video on. If you didn't check that out, check it out in the ride along playlist. Wildly sounded. I mean, right now, Check that GTR. Golly. It's sitting on the ground. Big old body, you just hear it out. <laughs> Damn, I guess they ran out of space in the venue. I have people out here. Way out here. That's pretty. That is nice. That is nice. That is nice. Gauze engine, notch back. <laughs> That's clean. That dash is clean. A little sketchy. Look at the window hood. It's a nice red. It's a nice red. Damn, look at these wheels. <laughs> That's just bright as woo. That is bright as hell. Walk past this Supra. This has a really clean kit on it. It's super clean too. I don't know what kit it is, but it's nice. What's up? Ooh, look at the Laurel. That's a no post Laurel. So these are cool. When the windows go down, there's no there's no B pillar. There's just an A and C pillar. So it's clean. QJ? Yeah. Beautiful FD, man. I want an FD so bad. I want too many things so bad. But the Advance on? With the Advance? Man. Hey, they got your shoes right there, dude. Oh, what's up? 
Chitty to Sedan, looking good. Ooh, FC with a hard top. Is that a hard top? Huh. Look at that. Targa is like a so it's like a blend, like a hard targa, soft uh, top, back, something. French, I don't know. French vanilla coffee creamer. <laughs> Look at the R32 three piece. Take the R32 wheels and make it three piece. And then a Lamborghini. <laughs> What's that? Too bad it's not twin turbo. How you get out here? Ooh, Wesley. Golly. The super induction and everything. Jeez. Got a smart metaphor. That is, that's nice. Another The who? Oh, that silver EG with some bronze C twenty eight eight. Ah. I love this front bumper and everything. I know. I'm sorry. That's that's clean. I like that. Well, you've been here all day. Yeah. There's another one, huh? My guys, I love the Hondas. Check this out. Jeez. You know, a lot of people polish this off, but I kind of like the steps on the aluminum from the Miller work. That's kind of cool. That 180, that hatch is nice. Yep. All right, check this thing out. Now this is a century. Look at the beautiful lace curtains and everything. That's clean. Boys came up from Florida with this one. Got the doilies on the seat, front and back. Sheesh. BBS wheels aired out. That's what, 22s? I can't see on the tire. Fortune Mines, I guess. That shit's cool. All right, guys, we're about to head out. It's about five. Everybody's rolling out. I don't believe I'm going to the after meet, but we're just gonna head down the road, see where it takes us. I don't know yet what we're doing. We'll see what's going on. It vibrated my whole car, man. Man, I think I'm gonna bump, 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 bump. Oh no, he's got flame. He's got a flamethrower. Who is? He's got a spark plug in his exhaust tip. Oh, this Mustang here? Oh, Jesus. Well guys, the day is over. Quick day trip up Chattanooga and back. Really fun, not too bad. It was awesome seeing some of you guys, seeing some of some cool cars. It's just an awesome venue with that big old pavilion and stuff. Really cool, really fun. But that was a quick day trip for Riverside. But hopefully I'll see some of you guys next year because I'll probably go back. It's a nice quick trip. So if you are thinking about it on the fence, just come on down. Let's go hang out at Riverside. It was pretty cool meeting for some of you. And until next time, guys, y'all have a good one. Y'all take it easy.